have been quite enjoying it. It's quite fun to get hold of the like camera and like have the like have your own voice to like guide people. My favourite part was getting the ideas all together for what films we're going to do, getting to the groups and sharing ideas. I've been finding it quite interesting, like meeting new people, learning new stuff about filming and stuff. I've been finding like, like uh, the filming really interesting as well. My favourite part is probably um, trying to figure out uh, the angles of where I put the camera. do a variation of work between theatre design, production design and art direction for photo shoots more recently, which is also really fun. So we read the script that Sophie's written and brought in and we start thinking about props, set design, costume, thinking about who our characters are, their relationship and stuff like that. It would be a fun thing to do as a career. I would love to direct or be in an action film, like Jurassic Park. That Jurassic Park is my all-time favourite film. We'll call action, okay? The shot will happen. We'll go through the whole thing. Either Darcy or Lola will call cut. And then we'll review whether we need to do another take or move on, okay? And action. I've been directing today, my experience has been overwhelmingly positive. I've quite enjoyed it. I think I've learned a lot about filmmaking, like learning about continuity and all these little details you have to get right. I've really found that bit quite intriguing. It's been a wonderful experience. Action! It would be exciting to see how everything's actually panned out because I think it's really different from seeing it being recorded and how it actually ends up being edited together. Attention to detail is the most important thing I've learned. You really need to like zoom in on every single aspect. My favourite part was definitely the sound. I did really like using the boom pole. Very good. I love the sound stuff. I love the technical stuff. Being included when I'm when I see my ideas, I, I don't feel like I'm being ignored, you know. But you can't really ignore because I'm too loud. But you know what I mean. How to do like the sound, how to direct, how to do script writing, you know all of the stuff that I didn't really get taught. This was amazing. I really enjoyed it. Nice. I like the boom, the boom pole a lot. Like trying to like get the sound in was actually quite fun, and like hearing a lot more than you can like the human ear hears, and like hearing what the boom pole hears was actually quite interesting. <laughs> I really like the camera. Yeah, doing the camera stuff. Like um, always keeping the acting frame when you're filming. I think it'd be cool just to see like like what we've made on the big screen for the millions of people. Yeah. I've seen that we've made a massive movie. I've seen it like we've made Dress of Park. <laughs> Running your voice has been an absolute treat. It's been fantastic to meet all of the young people. Real range of sort of experience in terms of like creative subjects and I think quite a lot of them had never done anything related to film and it's been fantastic just sort of watching them go from week one where we were kind of learning the very very basics all the way to the last day of shooting where it felt like a really cohesive professional looking crew and it was really exciting. Firstly, we want to thank everyone who was involved in these films. We have put our blood, sweat, tears and hard work into making these mini films. We also want to thank Sophie and Michael for starting the production. Without them, we wouldn't have found our skills, likes and passions in this filmmaking. Brilliant. Amazing. <laughs> to see all the progress we've done and actually been there and we got to watch it. My favourite film was Earth, Harrods and French. It was really 
funny and it was interesting to see how one character couldn't speak until the end and then when we all think he's going to say sorry he said something funny. Erlen Arlen is a friend. It's been a brilliant experience uh, for Mansfield Film Festival. It's nice to see all the different groups come together and all the, the week's worth of work that they've all put into. I just think that people need to be more involved in it through different angles as well. Because like my son definitely wouldn't want to be in front of the camera, but he's happy to do things behind the camera. And it's just knowing that there's things that you can do behind the scenes, and, but it all brings it together. Both the films are made were really good. Really enjoyed watching them, especially after seeing them um, spending two full days trying to film it all, and I didn't realise how long a process it was. And now I've seen it, it's totally worth it. I started watching films now and thinking, oh yeah, they've redone that bit and changed the angle. I've learned quite a lot as well as them. But I think they've developed lots of new skills. I think they've been able to communicate better and they've been able to learn a lot about art. So I think some of the people in there have decided it might be something they want to do later in life.